Hare Krishna. To put something behind us, we need something ahead of us. Often, some terrible things happen in our life. Either somebody betrays us or we ourselves act foolishly or ja life just gives us a very unfair deal. Now, if we are to move ahead in life, we have to put that behind. Unless we put that behind, our we stay caught in the past. And such staying caught in the past simply saps our energy. And the Bhagavad Gita says that such is misdirected determination in the mode of ignorance. Where we just keep living in the past, lamenting, moaning, wailing, complaining, blaming, all such things. So in the misdirected intelligence, we just go crazy by hurting ourselves by staying in the past. Now people may tell us, put that behind you. Now yes, to put something behind us, we need something ahead of us. We need to have something to look forward to in our life. To the extent we have that, to that extent we can move forward. Now, sometimes such a devastating reversal may occur in our life that we may feel that there's nothing ahead of me, my life is over. But it is at such time that spiritual knowledge can give us solace. We understand that Krishna is always ahead of us. On the journey of life, Krishna is with us and Krishna is Krishna is our companion and Krishna is also our destination. So the opportunity to serve Krishna, the opportunity to love Krishna is always there no matter what goes wrong in our life. And to the extent we, with the philosophical knowledge given in the Bhagavad Gita and by the practice of Bhakti Yoga as outlined in the Bhagavad Gita, we put Krishna ahead of us. Then we can put the past behind us. We can know that, okay, it has happened, but there's still something to look forward to in my life. Krishna is there. His service, His love, His grace is there. So it's still something which I can experience. And Krishna is so expert that whatever bad may have happened to us, it's not just a bad that we may have to tolerate. Krishna can even transform the bad and make some good out of it. So thus, by putting Krishna ahead of us, we can put the distressful past behind us. Thank you. Hare Krishna.